Another fire in our area is the South End fire burning near Canby in Clackamas County. Several homes were threatened and people living there evacuated as crews fought the flames. Yeah, crews struggled with tough terrain and getting those flames out as they climbed up a hill. Fox 12's Julia Lopez is live in Clackamas County. Julia, where do things stand right now? Well, as of one this afternoon, the South End fire has been considered contained thanks to a helicopter that was called in at just the right time. Right now, I'm off of 99 East near milepost 16, which has reopened after about 12 hours of closure today so that crews could fight the flames just feet away from homes in these hills behind me. What's scary is... We're just seeing the beginning of fire season. Just after midnight, Canby fire crews responded to a fire they believe sparked about 50 feet away from 99 East. As it spread to nearly five acres, they quickly realized they'd need all the help they could get. We're kind of on a bluff, um, and then the river in 99 East down below. And so that terrain is obviously very rough and rocky and hard, very inaccessible for the fire crews. So. Brian Smith could see flames early this morning from his house. When it first hit, um, our neighbors were evacuating their livestock and in a rush to get out and, you know, ask them if they need help. And they were at a moment there, they were just at a place where they thought they were losing it all. Smith lives down the road from the South End fire and was one of about 40 neighbors who spent the day on high alert with level three go now evacuation orders. Fire officials say they were extremely concerned for homes on this bluff because of how heavy and high the flames were burning and that it's unsafe to have crews working where it's so steep. That's why they say the Department of Forestry's helicopter saved the day. Every single one of those drops knocked down a giant chunk of that fire. He says the chopper left another local fire to fight this one for two hours. Because they were so close to the river, it only took a minute to gather water and then drop it. The helicopter did about 120 drops, with a 1,000 gallons hitting the flames each time. The helicopter uh, was amazing. Uh, it saved us probably about four days worth of work trying to get down to those hot spots. Canby Fire Chief Davis considers today a success, with no injuries reported and no loss of homes or livestock. But he says this is a reminder to us all to stay vigilant. I've been doing this for 50 years, and I would say that uh, 2020, well, I thought 2020 was a busy year. Uh, this is going to top 2020. Crews will be putting out hot spots over the next two to three days, but say they're confident those nearby homes will be safe. And with the fire burning so close to the highway, they say to keep an eye out for things like chains dragging on the road or cigarettes being thrown out of windows. For now, live from Clackamas County, Julia Lopez, Fox 12, Oregon.